Coming up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. Well, there is no denying this man's striking credentials. Prevailing wisdom is he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. He has to. You know, this is what got him to the show. It was being able to use the hands to set up the kick. We all talk about the high-level boxing background of this young man. But as he's developed, he's developed great knees. Yeah. He's developed great timing, great counter skills, and also the beautiful right high kick. The right high kick is something he hides very well as he follows with a jab right hand, left hook. High kick comes over the top, and he can put you to sleep. No doubt about it. He will try to put on a striking clinic once again here tonight. Well, this is about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive knees into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. Our tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Condit is 16 years the elder. The rest is nearly identical. How about some Bruce Buffer? Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC. Welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A kickboxer, holding a professional record of nine wins, no losses. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Ghost Dog. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A kickboxer holding a professional record of 32 wins, 15 losses. He stands 6 feet 2 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, USA. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the former UFC welterweight champion, the natural born killer, Carlos Condit. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. So here we go with round one. This young contender has won his last throw. And he throw. He has Bottom fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. It's now. That'll do it. Sir, it goes into the books as a first round win by knockout, near perfect execution. The technique was absolutely gorgeous. And again, when you catch a guy early, maybe you're getting him cold before he's had a chance to work up a sweat or even get into the fight a little bit. Those strikes can have a bigger effect, and it certainly did here tonight. Inside the octagon, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at 33 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Ghost Dog. Well, he's smiling ear to ear, and why not after a knockout like that? I didn't take it to the after party tonight. I mean, this is what dreams are made of. You dream of the knockout like this, and then the party after where you and all your coaches get to celebrate the great handiwork.